Grab, grab, grab the instruction guide for this video down below. Hey there folks, Peter here with BlackRock Business and today in QuickBooks Point of Sale we are going to talk about how you can weigh things and sell them in QuickBooks Point of Sale using a scale. This is just a real simple easy method of how to do it. Some people just haven't thought this through and so I thought you'd wa I'd walk you through it. Today we are going to sell some squash or gourds or something like that and we're going to sell these by how much they weigh. So let's walk through that. Before we do, I'm going to have you click on the link down in the description below to get over to our QuickBooks Point of Sale Facebook group. Tons of Point of Sale users in there helping each other every single day, posting questions, getting answers. Of course, I'm there helping you out as well. And if you're on YouTube today, don't forget to hit subscribe so you get all the latest, greatest QuickBooks Point of Sale videos coming at you all the time. All right, so you may notice on the screen I have a little video here of a scale. And this is just a regular everyday scale. I think I got this for 20 or 30 dollars off Amazon. I use it for shipping, but anybody who has a store can use any type of scale that reads out digital. Let's get going. I'm heading to the item list. I am going to create my squash item. And we are going to be selling squash by the pound. Uh, you know, you could put in kilogram or whatever your scale measures by in digital. Um, it'll just be really simple. We're going to sell squash and we're going to do it for, let's see, I, I'm going to say that when I buy my squash, uh, I do buy it for a dollar a pound. And when I sell it, I, I have no idea about squash pricing, by the way. So if this is way off, excuse me. Uh, I'm gonna sell it for a dollar fifty a pound. So this is squash by the pound, dollar fifty a pound. Get it? Uh, I have no produce department here, so we're gonna call this a gift. Okay, save. Okay, so now that we have that all set up, uh, this is this is almost too simple, um, and I'll show you. Uh, I'm going to turn my scale on and hopefully you can see it there. I think that's pretty visible. <clears throat> I'm going to make a sale. We are going to sell this to Cindy Erickson. And I'm going to say, okay, I'm ringing up a squash by the pound. And, oh, it says I have none in stock, but we know that's not true. Um, so, squash by the pound and easily I'm going to put this on my scale which is on my counter here now you can see on the scale there we've got two and a half pounds so really for a quantity up here I'm just gonna hit 2.5 and hit enter a tab now we can see that my dollar fifty a pound squash of which I have 2.5 of the of the weight of the pounds uh, that's gonna end up being three dollars and seventy five cents so there you go oh wait uh, my customer just said, oh my gosh, that is another nice squash right there. I need that as well. And so uh, we are going to add this to the ticket. And we can see on my scale there it's 5.6 pounds. And so selling squash by the pound, I'm going to change the quantity to 5.6. So 5.6 pounds at $1.50 a pound is going to be $8.40, please. Thank you very much. She hands me the cash and $8.40. There we go. There, now I have just used a simple scale and sold squash by the pound. You can do this with really any product, any scale, uh, any unit of measure. It could be pounds, ounces, um, you know, kilograms, grams, whatever you got, metric or imperial. And you just measure it and you enter in the quantity because you've already set how much it is for that uh, unit of measure using your scale. Very simple folks, I hope this helps you out in using scales in your business to sell things by weight and I, I don't think it could be any simpler. So I took the cash and then I save and print. My name is Peter with BlackRock Business. Thank you very much for coming along on this journey in selling things by weight using a scale. You have yourself an excellent day. Bye-bye.